Digital Facilitator, these are my favorite things to have in my toolkit so that I am always ready for whatever comes my way. Flip chart paper and a flip chart stand, which this is on. Personally, I like the kind that has sticky stuff on the back. Makes it very easy to write what you need to and then stick it onto a wall so that it can stay relevant and keep visual. Um, you know, stay somewhere where everyone in the meeting can still see it even when you move on to the next thing. I think that's actually pretty key. Then we're going to use some sticky notes. I like to have fun with color and get colorful sticky notes. I have a few colors here today. So these are my small sticky notes. And then I also sometimes will use the really big sticky notes. So I'm gonna demonstrate this using small sticky notes because of the limitations of space. But when I actually do this with a group, I would prefer to actually use a large whiteboard and then use these really big sticky notes so that people can write clearly and in such a way that you can just glance up there and see the idea really quickly. We'll get to that and it'll become obvious why that's useful. And we just said, write the idea. So then of course you need markers. I have my handy jar of markers. I personally prefer the Mr. Sketch Sniffy markers. Ooh, actually that one smells really bad. <laughs> what is this flavor? I think it's licorice. I do not like licorice, but some of them smell good. I think I need a palate cleanser for my nose to find one that smells better. Ah, that's much better. That is a generic, a watermelon and cherry, I think. Besides the topic, these are non-toxic. They do stain your clothes, so be careful with them. But I really like them. They add a little bit of element of fun. You'd be surprised how many adults in the workplace when you hand them a smelly marker. First of all, they immediately smell it. And then they just get a little bit nostalgic. They feel like, oh, okay, it's gonna be fun. I have a smelly marker. So those are a fun day. And then we will also be introducing stickers. Again, a lot of these tools translate to things you might find in an elementary school classroom, but they come in handy when you are facilitating meetings with adults. These particular stickers that I have here are nice because they are small, they are round, they are shiny, glittery, and they say wow on it. Or as my mom pointed out, mom, if you turn them upside down, I'll tell you how those come into play later. I have many other fun toys and tools in my facilitator tool bag, but these are the ones that are relevant for today's conversation.